Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Panic channel. Today I am going to teach how to make the calculator program in Csharp.net. First what I am going to go to the file. New project. Select Windows application. Here I am going to give the project name as calculator. Click finish button. Now what I am going to say, my form has been created successfully. I am increase size a little bit bigger. Right. Now first select the form. Right click. Properties. Your property window has been open. So now here. I'm going to the form name. I'm going to change it as calculator. Title calculator. Press enter key. The title has been changed it as calculator. Perfect. After that, what I'm going to see, I'm going to drag the text field. So here I'm going to uh, text field. Your search toolbox here. Drag and drop over here. Here I'm going to increase size to bigger. Like multi line. So to make it as multi line, so to increase the size a little bit, then only it will be look like as a calculator. Perfect. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is uh, do the buttons. So toolbox button. Drag the button over here. This button should be one. Select this one. One text one present. After that, I'm going to the property window. You have to get like this. You can easily change the font size as little bit. Select the font and 14 bit bold along with bold. Now it's okay. Perfect. Okay. Now the same thing. I just drag and drop. It's okay. Just we want to we just run and check. What is going on? You have to check the beauty of this one. It's okay if you if you like it is okay. You have to continue that stuff. I feel it's okay. Same thing. Control C to copy. Control V to paste here. Get another copy. Okay. This one should be two. But make that two plus enter key. Text only will be changed. Control C to copy. Control V to paste. This one should be three. Three. After that, same thing, control C to copy, control V to paste here. This one should be 4. This one should be control C to copy, control V. This one should be 5. Okay. Now, what I am going to do, this one, select this all, but make it here. Okay. Perfect. This is it. Now, here, the, all the text field, you just uh, button, you, uh, you just select all. We will select all, control C to copy, control V to paste and get another copy. Out of that, control C to copy, control V to paste and, and get another copy and you have to select like this. Give the space look like this. Right, perfect. Now here first what I am going to 6, this one should be 6, take 6, 7, 7, 8, 9, Zero. That's it. Now here we have to write a plus, minus, subtraction. Sorry, multiplication, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. This one should be clear. Little bit you have to make this button a little bit like this. Okay, perfect. Now what I'm going to do is we have to do another stuff is equal. So we need the same button. Control C to copy control V to paste here. This one should be we have to increase size little bit like this. This a button like this. We have to equal sign. 
x we are changing the equal to center key simple calculator program we will be given the simple design now what i am going to do is here select this one here we have a location starting location you have set it as center screen run again you will be able to see what is the position here it's running as a single sign but we are changing the size and all here we will be able to click it's perfect now get this calculator what i am going to do is select this one click here the font bold 24 it's enough let me check whether it's working or not 24 okay 24 is enough here it's working right now first what i am going to do is we have to do the process one by one this is the first button button one double click on this one just code your type before that we have to click on this text box field you have to name it as txt whatever name i will give you as display whatever name you can give i gave as the display whatever name you can give okay so display or uh, txt dot okay it's fine here you have right txt whatever is the name given here txt total dot text equal this one txt total dot text plus what's the name of the button button one button one so here let's check whether it's button two three four five six no one two three four five ten nine button right now let's name it as it's simple it's easy click on this one you have the button name you have changed it as b t n one press enter key this one should be your name is btn2 okay simple okay this one should be btn3 btn2 btn3 this one should be btn4 this one should be btn5 this one should be btn6 this one should be btn7 this one btn8 this btn9 this one btn0 this one btn plus this one btn minus this one btn multiplication multi this one btn division d that's it this one btn clear this one btn equal that's it now what I am going to see here, click double click on this one, btn, this one you have to read them, uh, click on double click on this one, so btn1, so we have changed the name, uh, so here you have to write txt total dot text, we call txt dot total dot the same thing the button name you have changed as plus btn one dot text that's it okay when you click on this button you can see here if you click one will be displayed because what is the value you are type on this text field it will be presenting here yeah, it will be presenting it okay the same thing we have to copy and paste it over here second one btn2 third one btn3 btn4 
can find you can six you can seven you can eight you can nine you can zero okay fine after that that's the stuff you have to do okay all the stuff you have to do the like this okay if you have click the button you will be able to check it here if you have click to for here it's working perfectly well okay so here now what i am going to do is now the process is working fine if you click on this here test it here it's working fine now instead of that you can do it this way is also okay here you have write like this also okay. plus press one this one this also you will be able to do it the same thing two instead of the button you will be able to do it the text also as well you don't need to change the button name and all be simply you write like this this also possible this also possible the previous one also possible this one also possible that's why i i will be explaining two methods this is second method Eight, nine, zero. That's it. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is this. Yeah, if you are click on this one, start here. It's working fine. Same thing like that on the display. Okay. So here now I'm going to do the this time. So I'm going to create the variables. string cal total int num1 int num2 string option int result we have created the first variable int num1 int number 2 int result we have two string variables created cal total and option right now what i am going to do is we have to do the calculation part here plus sign if you have click the plus sign what to do so here i will be explaining it without wasting time we already declare the variable above string option we get them here option equal plus if the request is coming plus what happen is it will be adding the values after that what i am going to num1 we have to put it here above num1 equal what is the value here on the on the uh, text box it will be assigning num1 okay it will be adding Okay, after add the values, we have to clear. So how to clear? Dot clear. Got to clear the values. Okay, so you like this. Two plus two. Okay, here it will work. Two plus two. Okay, two plus two is working. Okay, it's working fine. The same thing you have to do another thing as well. This one minus. If you have the clear is must then only it will be clear if you click 1 sorry 12 minus 3 what will be the answer if you click the equal sign answer want to display same thing this one this one should be multiplication multiplication this one should be division it's working as a division that's it that's it right now what i am going to say is clear okay we'll clear later on equal sign we have to do it okay paste it now here what i am going to do is uh, dot
number two what is the value on typing on this uh, here it will be checked if you click the equal button it will be checked what is the values are there calculate here you have to create the variable we have two different variable we have created now one and number two number two I have get it here what is the value of typing on the text field it will be assigning here if the option the option is selected as a plus so you write right here dot uh, equal equal option equal equal plus mean why it's a equal is working not equals okay not no problem that will be the option so equal so okay, yeah, equal is there that's all okay, you can write like this equals right dot dot equals otherwise you can write that this one also possible it's also working this is professionally i have used it this one okay option equals the professional i have used right if equals plus mean it will be add two values and assign to the variable if the operator is plus num1 num2 has had it and pass in the result here if it is minus it will be minus in the value if it is multiplication multiplication the value division division the value. this is a simple one it work okay if if you are uh, give the number one on the text box after that plus you have type the able to type the number two and equal to type uh, plus equal button what is the sign is there it will be calculate the value according to the value uh, what is the value you are type on the text field you have to click here plus two plus two answer will be why it's not working okay here the problem is here text result uh, the result is passing here uh, result okay sorry not like this it is passing like this like this method sorry that's why it the uh, error will be displayed result plus Now you will be okay. 2 plus 2 answer will be 4. If it's working fine. After that, after that you can write here 3 14 plus 78 answer will be working. After that minus it 70 it's working. Okay, it's working perfectly well. Now let's do the remaining another stuff the clear button please must you have to clear all the stuff so here some professionally clear all, all the stuff you have to write it here as uh, stuff this one you have to write like this dot clear right we have to clear the total text field first after that clear the variables one by one results variable mean this all the way temporary variables we have to clear okay the result is zero num one zero number two zero all the temporary variable must be clear num one is you must clear two clear result clear then only to work here we are going to seven plus two equal clear it will be clear now again you have to eight into two answer with 16 it will work in fine i hope you guys you understood the things well if you have any doubt you can ask me anytime thank you for watching